And with a victory for local governments today, Senate Bill 61 failing on the Senate floor. Now, if it passed, it would have allowed the state to light the way for digital signs to be used in any zone where cities allow, but without a say from the cities themselves. ABC 4's Nicole Newman joining us from Salt Lake City to explain. We are outside of the Italian restaurant Veneto here in Salt Lake City, and you can see that this is the issue. A large billboard right on the side of this restaurant that the owner says is an eyesore, and if it was digital, that it would cause even more problems. Well, it has a major impact as far as aesthetic. It's lights out for now for Senate Bill 61 after it failed in a 12 to 15 vote today on the Senate floor. The bill, which specifically deals with outdoor advertising, proposes regular billboards like this one outside of Veneto's be potentially converted to a digital sign. That's without a say from local governments. I would not even think about having strobe lights and colorful lights and, and lights all day and all night. From the local government perspective, we feel like decisions about signs and billboards really ought to be made at City Hall. The Utah League of Cities and Towns says that's when cities can sit down with property owners and neighbors to make these decisions. Provost Mayor Michelle Kafusi supports this idea. In a statement telling ABC4, shouldn't local officials and by extension the citizens of an area be able to decide what their community looks and feels like including on electronic billboards. With seven days left in general session, there is a possibility the bill could resurface. At the Capitol, Nicole Newman, ABC4 News.